to solve the problem, let's try to express a plus b and a minus b in terms of b. To do that, let's add b squared to the given condition. So the left side becomes a squared, the right side becomes b squared plus 2ab, right? So we denote that as condition star. Now we consider the perfect square formula, a minus b squared. We know it is a squared minus 2ab plus b squared. Now we can use condition star to replace a squared. So we get b squared plus 2ab minus 2ab plus b squared. So 2ab minus 2ab canceled. b plus b, so we get 2b squared. Now take square root for both sides. So we get a minus b equals plus minus square root of 2b squared. We can write as plus minus square root of 2 times b. So we have two cases to consider. The first case, a minus b equals square root of 2 times b. In this case, both sides plus 2b because we want to create a plus b. So the left side is a plus b. The right side, square root of 2 times b plus 2b. So we can write as square root of 2 plus 2 times b. So a plus b over a minus b equals a plus b. We know square root of 2 plus 2 times b. a minus b. So which is square root of 2 times b. Cancel b. So we get square root of 2 plus 2 over square root of 2. Now, top and bottom times square root of 2. So then the bottom becomes 2. The top, square root of 2 times square root of 2, 2. 2 times square root of 2, 2 square root of 2. Top and bottom divided by 2. So we get 1 plus square root of 2. The second case, if a minus b equals negative square root of 2 times b, then again, plus 2b to create a plus b. So a plus b equals 2b minus square root of 2 times b. So we can write as 2 minus square root of 2 times b. So the target expression a plus b over a minus b, plug in, so we get 2 minus square root of 2 times b. a minus b equals negative square root of 2 times b, cancel b. So we get 2 minus square root of 2 over negative square root of 2. Top and bottom times negative 1, so we get square root of 2, the top becomes square root of 2 minus 2. Now, top and bottom times square root of 2 times square root of 2, right? So the bottom becomes 2, the top becomes 2 minus 2 times square root of 2. Divide 2 for top and bottom, we get 1 minus square root of 2. So we have two solutions to the given equation. 1 plus square root of 2 and 1 minus square root of 2. If you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you.